guys, Dashon here, and today we are discussing the true purpose of the of Sarah and Kate's daughter, Princess Flurry Heart. And no, it is not merchandise. Toys, buy your toys. <laughs> and no, it is not merchandise as much as the Brony Notion thinks it is. You can go watch his video on Toy Hearts True Purpose because it's well, what her not being true all because that's kind of cool as well. Well, now let's just get, just get straight out to business and stop messing around with fan songs. And then it hasn't stated that Twilight and since according to the chapter books, which I take some of these to be canon and some of them not to be. Like, personally, I think that, um, Vero Dash and Daring Duke Double Dare, it probably isn't canon because the half girl is horseshoe. But that Twilight Strike on the Crystal Hearts belt is just because it doesn't go against anything that is canon. The reason why Vero Dash and Daring Duke Double Dare isn't canon is because Daring Duke currently has the half girl the horseshoe. So how does the core get it? Or who whoever had it? In that I think it was the core. How does the core get it if Daring Do currently has it in Forbidden City of Clouds, which is canon? See my point? So I'll go into that book and later in um Princess Case and the Pissed Up and the Glitter Hard Guard, which is what it's called. Yeah, because I know these books are different names. Because yes, I have a whole pile of all these books next to me. They also mentioned this backstory again, I think. I, I know, in one of the other books they mentioned it as well, again. That Cadence used to be a Pegasus. So Twilight, by extension Cadence, are immortal as Twilight will not out with her friends. Which has been confirmed. Although, uh, nice still we can and might not. And I doubt all the main seven of Queen Alcorns. <laughs> like, don't know how long dragons will be there. But anyway, so we know Cadence will eventually die. So who's going to take over the Crystal Empire? Flurry Heart!